Running footy here. Partington again. Releases Partington. We got some back really good. In this last quarter, he's stepped up. Partington, he got it in a handball from Kidman. Partington steps around the would-be tackler. Has a shot off goal. Don't tell me he's kicked the ripper. Luke Partington shows his class. I'm a little fella, so I'm... Uh, in and under and um, like to win my own footy but then also like to get on the on the spread and have a bit of a run and carry with the ball so yeah that's how I like to play my game. Yeah well Tumby Bay is a small country town quite Port Lincoln it's about two and a half thousand people in the district so um, great place to grow up lots of swimming lots of fishing lots of lots of fun things to do so that was great and then the time comes where I guess you gotta you gotta move to the, the city and try and make a career out of footy and education as well I guess. I think it'll appeal to AFL clubs that have already moved away from home. Bobble the hand pass out and over. Partington did well through heavy traffic. Chance now here running through the middle of the ground here as the red legs go and it's a kick by Partington. He took a bounce. I've always wanted to play AFL. I grew up playing it from ever, ever since I was five so parents sort of took me out to Auskick and then yeah just fell in love with the game ever since. My strengths are having clean hands and being clean with the ball, distributing it cleanly and uh, decision making and then um, being able to run and carry the footy is another one. Over the uh, last year or so I've sort of modelled my game on Lockie Neal. He's got the runner, Neal! He's a similar type player to me and similar height, similar weight, similar attributes so yeah, that's someone who I watch closely. February of this year, I, I lost my father to a to a mining accident. That's been a, a massive driving um, force for me. Um, he's given dad gave me and and my mum as well gave me all the op endless opportunities that I've that I need and to try and play AFL footy. So it's really rewarding myself and rewarding my family for the effort and sacrifices they've made. It was hard and I took a lot of time, but um, yeah, I felt like I was able to get through it, and in the end, I was able to play some reasonably good footy. I think if you um, had have asked me in February that what I've achieved is what I was able to do, I probably would have said, uh, no way. The draft, I haven't really been thinking about it too much. I've been trying to focus on other things and focus on performance, I guess, and just let the things happen as they come and just take everything on board as it happens. I can't throw it away. I need to do everything I can to make sure that I get to the highest level.